going to talk about the sort command. The sort command is a neat little feature to help uh, display your data a little better. Often when you have tables, people say, I don't need the sort command because I can do it myself. And there's some truth to that, but there are places where you will actually want to control the way the data comes back. By default, Splunk will return the values from the latest log using the underscore time field to the oldest log. And that's how it sorts. Um, but you can change that behavior. And it's pretty simple. We'll just do our index equals lame training, source type equals lame con, and I'm going to sort by bytes in. And if I do that, let's just, let's make it really easy. So I'll just do table bytes in so that we just see just that data. And now we'll get the smallest bytes in all the way to the largest. Now, if we want to switch the order, all we have to do is put a negative sign. Now, the thing I often do when I screw it up, I'll put a negative sign right next to my bytes in. Don't do that. Put a negative sign and then a space. The It actually takes a plus or a minus, but just remember that um, you don't need the plus. It's implied. So if I do a negative, I can get my bytes in. I can even do, I told you that time, we have a time field, and then I can go flip this. And so if I don't do anything, time will come back. Newest event to the latest. If I flip this, now it'll give me the oldest event. Actually, in this case, it did not. Um, do I need to go plus time? Yep. So by default, uh, the default, just so we know, is actually negative time. It's descending order. I always get descending and ascending order. So uh, feel free to make comments if I screw it up. I will. Uh, the point is, if you want to make the things go the other direction, you use a plus time. Uh, the other things you can do, we can do, uh, let's, bytes in bytes out, and I can sort I can sort by multiple fields, and thereby, if two fields, it's going to first sort by bytes in, and if there are more than one field coming back with the exact same number, then it will give me, it will use the next field to determine which one comes first. We can also switch this around. You can put a plus here and a minus here. You can play around with it. Big reason you want to do this is often you'll get results back and you don't want the analysts having to change directions here to view the stuff uh, of importance. You want to be able to show that stuff immediately. When you want to control the way the results come back, you're going to want to use that sort command. I hope this helps. Uh, that's the sort command in a, in a nutshell. Hope that uh, if you like this, please uh, like the channel, subscribe, um, and I hope this helps you on your journey from becoming a lame analyst to a Splunk Ninja.